Your eyes getting so wonder, you, you wonder got lust in your eyes, you and lust and, and lust in your eyes, and and, and, and you all about the, the lust of the flesh and, and you all in the pride of life, all about you. Y'all put me up, have a big party for me. Amen. Put me up. Amen. Y'all help. Y'all, y'all need to have me a big party. Honor me. Amen. Put me in charge. How many times people have bought the pot? Paid the money for the pot and told the people to lie. Say, hey, just this this say you doing it for me. Do you know people do that? They will give the man the money and say, this say you have the party for me. They ain't gonna know it. You're supposed to be in church though. Just say you have a surprise birthday party for me. And I'm going to give you all the money. And they won't know it. God knew it. Thank you, Lord. I don't need, a, I don't need no party that bad. I don't need no, I don't need no party. Because you know what? You're the one going to... God is looking at you for to be an example. Amen? Somebody got the... The Bible said even clearly said, You know what? The devil's so crickly. He'll make you feel like that you need a party. He'll work through the enemy. You know you need to do just do something for yourself. You get no. You need to have your party. Let me just tell you something. It's not about me. It's not. It's about. It's about God. It's not about me. It's about Jesus Christ who died for us, went to the cross for us. He went to the cross that we have life. Do you not know that God gave His only Son that who shall believe in Him shall not die, but should have a right to tree of life? He gave His only Son. He went to the cross that we may live. And now we play in church? You know the devil is after your mind. Don't let him mess with your mind. Amen? Be more established in God. Be established in God. Be focused. Be focused minded. Amen? Amen. You got to be so focused of his tricks. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Be be so focused of the devil tricks and knowing what he's about. You got to know what the devil is about. And don't don't fool yourself. Because the Bible says he's like a roaring lion seeking who he may devour. Don't fool yourself. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. He's out to destroy you. Thank you, Lord. He's out to destroy you, and he's trying to get you set up for it. Amen. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Amen. Thank the Lord. Amen. Thank the Lord. Proverbs 20, 30, 34, verses 1 and 3, 1 through 3. He said, The Lord battle. Amen. The Lord battle with those who battle with him. Amen. He fight against those who fight against him. He picks, he pick up, he pick up a shield of armor and he raised up. Raise us up to help. Amen. To help us. To help me. Amen. Thank you, Lord. He lift up the shield, both large and small, against those who chase me. Amen. He tells me, he takes me, and saves me. Let me tell you something. The Lord will lift up a shield against your enemies. Amen. He will fight against those that fight against me. Amen. I ain't got to worry about nothing. See, the battle is the Lord's. Amen. I don't have to worry about no battle. Amen. Thank the Lord. See, when the enemy tried to type me in my mind, all I got to say, Lord, you see. Amen. Thank the Lord. We got to cast down every thought that may come up against the knowledge of God. Cast it down. That anything that come up to, to, to corrupt the, the, your mind. Because don't fool yourself. The devil want to corrupt your mind, your thinking, you focus on God. He want to make you think on other things. Word itself. Word, he want to corrupt your thinking. He don't want you to think about scriptures. He don't want you to think about word. Amen. He wants you to think about corrupt things. Amen. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Uh, uh, Deuteronomy 28 uh, and 7. The Lord shall cause my enemies that rise up against thee. Thank the Lord. To rise up against you to be smitten before my face. Amen. If my enemy rise up against me, God said, I'm going to have him be smitten right in front of my face. I ain't worried about the devil. Anybody oppose me, God said, my enemies, he said, I'm going to cause them to be smitten. Right in front of my face. Rise up against. If your enemy come up against you, you got to know that God is with you. The Lord shall cause your enemies that rise up against you, that come up against you, talking about you, backbiting, they want to do you all kind of harm. I don't worry about the devil. God said, I got your back. Amen. He said, I, he said, those that rise up against you, that try to do you harm, he said, I will cause them to be smitten before thy face. Amen. Thank you. And they shall not come out against thee. They shall come up against thee. They shall come out against thee one way and flee before you seven ways. Oh, help me, Lord. He's going to cut them up. 
Thank the Lord. They may come at one. They may come at you one way. He said yes. He said, but they're gonna leave in seven ways. Seven. He said, I'm gonna cut them up. You don't worry about the devil. Amen, amen. I'm colored. I'm establishing my mind. I'm so glad that God got my back. I'm so glad that He would call the enemy. He said, don't worry about your enemy. Let them rise up against you. I was, I was in the car and I've got a little peace. I felt and something about confidence. I feel confident in Christ Jesus. Anytime I'm doing something for God, you got to go with confidence. I'm so confident in Him that God got my back. I don't worry about the devil. You worry about the devil, the devil already got you. You need to throw, you know what you need to do? You need to cast any throw thought that tried to interrupt the flow of the Holy Spirit, you need to let the devil know, take a flight devil, I'm great as he that's in me, that he that's in the world. I don't care if you don't believe in me, I know what God is about. God is about saving his people. He's about covering their, his people. Oh, help me, Lord, preach his word. Woo, I feel good. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Let me just, just give you a little bit of a uh, few nuggets. Amen. One thing about the enemy, he know he's gonna lose. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. He know he's gonna lose. So, but he he tried to he tried to make you think that he got that he gonna he gonna win. But as a man thinking in his heart, so is he. God Almighty. You think you defeated? You already defeated. Amen. Thank you, Lord. If you think you can't make it, you can't make it. You already done failed. If, if everything you think, if you think you can't do nothing, you won't do nothing. If you think you can walk around unbelief and you and you say I will never achieve what I go after, guess what? You won't achieve what you go after. As a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. The mind got to be established in God. When I wake up in the morning, my mind is on Jesus. I grab my Bible. I begin to read Scripture, read read the Word of the Empowered by the Word of God. I'm established in my mind. See, the Word that I plant in my heart is established me in my going, in my walking, and with God. It established me. It put my foot on solid ground, solid rock. I'm established in Jesus. Why? Because I know it's going to take the Word to establish me. It's going to take the Word of God to plant me and keep on doing what God called me to do. Devil, the devil ain't got no tricks. Amen. He, 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 the Bible says his, his, he, 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 he ain't got no tricks. Amen. It's, it's everything that he's doing, we already know. Amen. Paul said, I'm not ignorant concerning the, the, uh, the tactics and the tricks of Satan. We, we should know by now. All these many years that we've been in church, and, and we've been in church enough to know what the devil's about. He worked through our family. He worked through our children. Amen. And, and he worked through our, our in-laws, outlaws. He worked through, he's out your family. Your, amen. Your friend. Your, your, he works through people that are trying to attack you in your mind. But the Bible said, put on the whole arm of God. Amen. Thank the Lord. And then the, the, the brother Isaiah uh, 54 and 7, he said, no weapon formed against thee shall prosper. You got to understand God is not going to let the devil make a weapon to take you out. Woo! Good God Almighty. He said, I ain't, I ain't going to let the devil make no weapon to take you out. No, no. Uh-uh. It is not going to be to come up against you. Amen. Thank the, I thank God for that. Because See, the enemy, he wants you to think that God, see, see, God is in control of everything. Why would the God of, that we serve let the devil make a weapon, amen, thank the Lord, that take you out? When that brother said, goody, 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 devil, you didn't do it. You know why? God got you covered. Amen. The enemy, see, the enemy, his job is still kill and destroy. But when you covered by the blood, say, I'm covered. Amen. Look at your name. Say, neighbor. I'm a covered. I'm covered by the blood. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I'm getting ready to go. Amen. Luke 22, verses 31 and 32. Amen. Thank you, Lord. And the Lord said, Simon, Simon, behold, Satan has desired to have you. Thank you, Lord. That he may sift you as we. But I pray, but I have prayed for thee that ye have faith and faith and fail not. Amen. That ye have faith and fail not. And when thy art converted, strengthen your brother. Good God Almighty. See, uh, 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 this, this is Jesus talking to Peter. He said, Simon, Simon, the devil is desires is, is to have you. He eat that behold Satan desires to have you. But God said, Jesus said, I pray for you. See, the devil wanna, he said, he went on to say, he said, Satan wanna get you, man. 
He, he's in 